Mel here. So today we are going to be talking about a hair butter. Uh, this is a long trust whipped shea butter in the scent cookies and flowers. Um, so uh, I decided to review this um, with them. Um, this is a sponsored video just so you know. And when they reached out to me they were like oh we actually want you to review this hair butter and they sent me the link and I saw the scent and I was kind of like what? <laughs> I mean, okay, you guys know I don't really like floral scents, and you know I like a Ramon scents. Um, so to combine the two, I was a little bit skeptical of. Um, but just so you know, this is a shea butter, grapeseed oil, and vitamin E oil mix. Um, it's fair trade, cruelty free, um, and Along Trust is a black owned brand, I believe, so that is always good. Um, but okay, so it's you know a regular butter. It is very very thick but also creamy at the same time it like absorbs into your skin very well without getting what do you call it that dryness that kind of like dry sheen that some oils get once they start to dry down this almost makes it seem like my skin is staying moisturized on my skin I've used this on my skin on my hair um pretty much you know like put it put it on your feet and put socks on at night and all that kind of stuff and I also thought that this was a perfect opportunity to review this butter because uh, my hair is blown out right now and I did wand curls uh, for a wedding over the weekend. I don't know if you saw that picture on my Facebook, but I've just been leaving my hair in a bun and taking it out and just, you know, wearing it or putting it in like a braid for the day. Um, and I, I won't lie to you right now, I don't really like my hair today because I only slept with it in one bun and usually I do two or four to get like more uh, curl definition or something like that, like more wavies. And, uh, this is just kind of you know, to me, but it's okay because I'm just chilling. Uh, but anyway, so yeah, this is a nice mix. It's not drying um, and it does absorb eventually. So you know how sometimes like butters, um, when you wear them, they kind of just make your skin feel oily and they don't feel like they've fully absorbed into your skin. This one does not do that at all. It definitely eventually absorbs and then you don't have any of that greasiness. So. When it was a little bit warmer and I was wearing shorts, um, I was totally fine with like putting this on my legs and not thinking that when I got in my car, my legs would be like a greasy mess. Um, so that was great. Then also, so I know you're trying to, you're like, girl, like you're talking about all this stuff, like just talk about the smell. Okay, I'll be honest. It smells really good. <laughs> It really, really does. I was actually kind of surprised. And if you see this light fading in and out, it's because the sun is like peeking in and then peeking out. Bye, sun. Like, whatever. I don't even need you. Um, but so, yeah, it smells awesome. And it, the picture of the cookies, I don't know if you can see this. It's macarons. First of all, I love macarons. Um, and it has more of a gourmand scent than um, the flower scent. And the flower scent is like this really, really light floral. It just smells so good. Like I'll put it in my hair like when I'm fresh when I wash and go. Um, works perfectly for how I'm wearing my hair right now. Like rub it in, put some of my ends before I put it up in a bun and all that kind of stuff. I'm probably going to put my hair in a bun after this video so it's probably good that I'm doing this. Um, but yeah, it's really, really nice. And I had it on one day um, when I went to Ulta and the woman who worked at Ulta, she was like, you smell so good. And I'm like, what? And I totally forgot that I was wearing this. Um, and it just, it smells so good. And it, it does like tend to fade throughout the day, you know, like most butters and scents and perfumes and things like that. Um, and and it, you get used to it and you don't smell it anymore. But then when someone else smells you, they're like, whoa, like, oh, this smells amazing. And I just, I'm obsessed with it. It's so weird. Um, I don't think... I've ever smelled a butter with such like a unique smell and I just really really like it um, but yeah you can you know it just says for your skin for your hair you know proceed as usual I don't really um, do twist outs or things like that with butters only I usually use like a water-based thing so I wouldn't use it for that but I put it on like my edges my ends um, when I am putting my hair back in a bun like you know how when your hair is straight Throughout the week, your um, edges start to get frizzy, and you know you see you see the curls start to come back. So I smooth that on my um, edges, and then I'll like put a scarf on my head at night, 
um, to kind of smooth those out. And it's just lovely. I don't know. I feel like you just have to smell it to understand. Because <laughs> it smells so good. But, um, yeah. And it also says, so, nourishes hair with essential fatty acids, vitamin A, E, and F. Um, so it's whipped, so they say like, shea butter is firm, so it's really easy to get out. It's not like you have to stir it around or anything, whether it's winter or summer. So being that it's getting colder, I think that that is freaking awesome. So, I mean, I don't really have anything else to say about it. I think this is about 16 or $17 on their website for 8.45 ounces. So this is going to take me forever to use up. I have butters this size that are probably years old and they're still good um and I still use them so I mean I'm very happy with this and I'm gonna be smelling like um, I'm still gonna be smelling like summer and desserts in the middle of fall so yeah that's really all I have to say but if you have questions um if you want to know about any other butters I use because I do have like a large collection of butters if you want to see another video on that please let me know um but yeah and that's pretty much it. So I will talk to you all later and you have a wonderful day. Thank you again for watching. As always, I appreciate you. Um, leave a comment, say hello, and I'll talk to you later. All right, bye.